Rub up your engines. You can have a luxury car without paying a ton of money for it. Of course all the manufacturers put all the new accessories and fancy technology in their luxury cars to get you to pay more money to buy one. And sure, my wife is driving this Lexus, but then again, I only paid $3,000 for it used with 60,000 miles on it too. You're not gonna find something like that. But there's a way to put all those cool new accessories and technological gadgets on your car, turning it into a luxury car, at least inside, for a fraction of the cost of a new luxury car. And my first example is this lace sauce projector beam. No, it's not a sauce to put on your filet mignon. Crazy name for a company, but they make these cool side door markers on the inside. You simply just pop out your old marker light assembly and plug this projector housing in. Snap it in and with a little wiggling, there it goes. And then it looks really cool at night like this. And here's how cool it looks at night. Ooh, out it comes. And here's a shot from outside the car when the door opens. Ooh. And if you have a wicked sense of humor, hey, put a Lexus or a Tesla on your Dodge Neon. At night, if people don't know cars and they see that, you can say, oh, this is special Tesla. It looks like a Dodge Neon, but it's really a Tesla. <laughs> I've driven modern luxury cars that have these on it, and guess what? They're like $60,000, $70,000 up. This little set is $14.99 for two of them. <laughs> and speaking of making a car look more luxurious, these are the original ugly headlamps that came on this old Lexus. It's a 2002. They were just plain halogen, pretty ugly looking. But I swapped them out with this beautiful angel eye setup. Aftermarket, bolted right in, a little dark black in them, much sharper looking. You get the modern look at a fraction of the cost. A few hundred bucks in this case, versus the $50,000, $60,000 car. And you can do the same thing with any car. This Matrix, it had really ugly front headlights. I put in fancy custom ones, dark inside. These babies are only like 60 bucks a piece for the whole thing. And I put these snazzy backlights on. The original ones, hey, they were pretty ugly. Not snazzy or looking for 50 bucks again. Now let's say a car doesn't have the technology you want, the readouts gas mileage, water temperature, whatever. This cool little Autel device works fine. This cool little gauge set, Aw tool, works quite good and it's so easy to install. You just take the business end and plug it into the OBD port. And now it's setting itself up. Look at all the stuff it can do. You can make a speedometer. You can have the distance you're driving, a trip distance. You can have a clock. You can have your ignition advance oil temperature, oil pressure, fuel level, engine load, throttle position, map sensor data, fuel pressure, voltage, everything you want. Hey, for less than 40 bucks, that's pretty cool. You can mount it wherever you want. And let's say, I've even used this for customers. I had a customer that had a speedometer that stopped working. The speedometer head went bad inside the dash. They would have to replace the whole dash. It was over a thousand dollar job. But with this gauge, you got a speedometer right here. It's showing the water temperature and the charging voltage, and you can put all different configurations in. But hey, for less than 40 bucks, it saved the speedometer not working. It was gonna cost him over a grand to fix correctly. Now in his case, he was mad because he couldn't get his car inspected. He had to have a working speedometer. He wanna spend a thousand bucks with this. Hey, for 40 bucks, he's got a speedometer he can put wherever he wants. He can legally get his car inspected. And it does have an awful lot of information. Real fancy cars have, but now your own car can have it just by plugging it in and mounting it wherever you want. So all in all, it's pretty cool. Have all the modern convenience electronics of a fancy luxury car. Or you can just plug into your own car. The only thing I've got against this is I can't use it on my old Celica. Because the Celica is OBD1 because it's 1994. This only goes on the 1995 and newer OBD2s. That's pretty old 1995 to the present, so it'll fit a lot of cars. Now let's say you crave modern convenience like a backup light camera, a dash cam or collision avoidance systems. Stream media dash camera can fit your needs if you want that technology, but don't want to buy another car. <laughs> you can mount it over your rear view mirror and you can have it as a dash cam. You can have it as a rear view mirror camera. 
it has night vision it has pretty good night vision of course you can mount it wherever you want but if you want to use it for night vision now i'm getting old and i can't see that well at night anymore you could mount it right above your dash like right here stick it up there and then at night hey you can see way far ahead with the night vision they always say well you're not supposed to be distracted when you're driving well if you have night vision in front of you where you're looking you can see an extra few hundred yards hey that's something look at all the features it has speed driving mode resolution you can record endless loops you can have parking mode sensitivity so when you hit your car when it's parked it'll film them goes on and on and on parking lines gps information and if you get the fancy version hey it even has driving assist warning if somebody's getting too close on the side or you're getting too close or you're going out of your lane these things have a lot of technology in it for a reasonable amount of money too it's not outrageous this particular one's like 160 dollars and there's tons of them out there you want state-of-the-art technology hey you don't have to buy a new car you can just buy the technology and add it onto your car. The last bit of technology I'm gonna talk about is wireless charging. Maybe you have a phone that can be charged wirelessly, but your car can't do it. Well, with this Robo Q1, you can have a wireless charger in your car. Now, of course, it needs a power supply, so it's plugged into the cigarette lighter. But you can mount this wherever you want, like in your vent. Then when you want to charge your phone, watch this, you just stick it in. It grabs it. And now it's charging. So your old car is now a high-tech modern car with wireless charging for your phone. And it's great for your GPS, of course, you know. You can mount it wherever you want. I got it in the vent here. It comes with all this stuff in the kit. Or you can use this other mount. Got glue on it. You can stick it wherever you want. You got a phone that can be charged wirelessly. You don't have to worry about carrying cords everywhere you go. And since this is Mechanic Monday, I'm going to be giving away one of these cool dash gauges that does all those cool OBD2 functions. To have a chance to win, place a clean, non-offensive comment on the YouTube comments below. And a winner will be chosen randomly by computer to get a little gauge that'll tell you more information than you probably ever want to know about your car while you're driving it. So if you never want to miss another one of my new car repair videos, remember to ring that bell.